Today's conversation is sponsored by First Generation Capital Partners. If you're an accredited investor and you want to know about how we're helping other accredited investors keep more of their income, go to firstgencp.com forward slash going long. You're listening to the Going Long Podcast with Billy Keels, the number one podcast for long distance real asset investing. Welcome to the Going Long Podcast. We're back once again to continue to help to educate you so you feel much more comfortable as well as confident investing beyond your backyard. And yes, I'm back. I'm Billy Keels and I am here as your host. And I'm really, really thankful that you decided to invest your time with me over the next couple of minutes. Today is going to be a very short, 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 short solo episode. But I also want to thank every one of you that continues to be back here and continues to share about our podcast across social media. You're tagging us, you're tagging me across LinkedIn, across Instagram. Thank you so much. Continue to do that because it also helps bring new uh, family members, podcast family members uh, forward that will be with us. Uh, Also too, if you want to leave an honest written review, you still have time to do that. Just, uh, well, we made a video for you. It's really easy on the Apple platform. You can go there and do that uh, as well as Spotify. So we'd love to have you do that. Um, but you know, today in this kind of solo conversation, there's been so many wild things happening in life right now. Like this is just a time where so many different things are happening and we're being bombarded with so much different information. And at the end of the day, and, and I guess, well, let me kind of take a step back, right? So, so many different things that are happening in life. I, last week or this week uh, in our newsletter, because we have a newsletter for our, our community. I don't know if you, if you want to find out more about that, you can, uh, but I, I like to write my thoughts and, and just kind of what's happening. Um, if you go to firstgencp.com over there, you can find out and you can sign up for our newsletter. I think it's there on the, on the homepage. Just go there to the bottom and you can be informed as well. But this week, it's been like any other week, right? It's just been very unique in that I saw so many different conflicting reports of information, right? So I wanted to share that with the group. And, and the headline was of one of the, the, the pieces that I wrote was 40,000 out of work at Amazon, Google, and Microsoft. Like all this happened within five days. 40,000 people, a little over 40,000 people from one day to the next lost their jobs. They lost their jobs. And this was with a backdrop of unemployment, the unemployment rate, at least the published rate, and we can get into shadow stats and all that kind of stuff. But let me just go with this one, right? The one that's reported at 3.5%. So 40,000 people lost their jobs, but at the same time, unemployment is extremely low. That was tough. But then it was this third data point was the one that was really, really interesting to me. And this is the one that I want to share with you because it said, According to, to monster.com, a whopping 96% of workers are looking for a new job in 2023. So we have these workers, just kind of three different pieces, right? We've got a 3.5% unemployment rate. So it seems like a lot of people are working, but even though a lot of people are working, well, 40,000 at just these three companies in five days lost their jobs. But then to top it off, 96% of people are also looking for a new job. So I only wanted to kind of put this out there because the the thing is, and this happened to me, it happened to me in 2000 when I lost money from my 401k, my IRA, it came back. And when it came back, I lost it again. I lost 33% of it in 2008. And it was kind of like when, and I think I've talked about this before, like my parents taught me something happens once, shame on them. If the same thing happens again, twice, shame on you. And I think about these constant cycles and, you know, I worked for a really large corporation. I've only worked for large corporations when I was in my corporate world, right? One company now has over 110,000. Another has over 150,000 employees. And so these are cycles. These things happen. You know, you're, you don't want to have that fear of, is your name going to be on the list? You know, and if your name is, was on the list and you're a, a going long podcast family member, reach out to me, respond to me. Let me know. There's somewhere that I can connect you with somebody or something to help you get the next step or move forward, I'd be happy to do that. But what I also want you to think about is of that 96% of people who are looking for a job, the question is, how many of you are actually looking to create the lifestyle that you want and being able to gravitate to those activities, those people, those networks that are going to allow you to build your lifestyle, not just necessarily work a job, right? I worked a job for 26 years. That working that job eventually had a purpose in working that job. And that afforded me a lot of things to be in the point in life where I am today. So that in my late forties, don't have to worry about working um, in a large corporate anymore. The things that I do every single day, the people that we are serving, 
give me so much positive energy. It's amazing. Yes, I liked my job. At the same time, I love the life that I'm living now. Why? Because it's the lifestyle that I designed. Uh, It's the lifestyle that I wanted. And so when you're given an opportunity in life, i.e., maybe one day to the next, you have a change of your situation. Are you just going to do the next thing like what everybody else does? Are you going to really take that opportunity and say, okay, what is the life that I'm looking to design? How can I make the most of this opportunity? Right? So it's something that's on my heart, right? And so I just wanted to share that with you uh, as a going along family member and think about it. You know, do you know somebody that you can be that influence, that impact on them to say, great, go for the next job if that's what you want to do. But what is that job? What's the purpose of that job? What role is it really going to help you feel for your life, for your design? Because that's what I'm thinking. And that's what I would be thinking if I was one of those 40,000 people taking all that information in. So don't just do the next thing that as everybody else is expecting you to do. Really focus on what it is that you want out of this opportunity that you have been gifted for whatever reason. And I know it doesn't feel good right now. It probably is pretty painful. No one likes losing their job. Take this opportunity, make the most of it, and really seize this opportunity to create the best version of the best life that you can live. So I'm going to leave it there. I want you to think about that. Like I said, just sharing some of the things I've shared with uh, with our newsletter. If you're interested in finding out more about the newsletter, uh, like like I said, go over to our firstgencp.com. Find out at the the bottom. You can just sign up for the newsletter. It would be great. Uh, You can start to share, see a lot of the different things that I'm thinking about, talking about, what our community is all talking about, and uh, would be fantastic. So listen, I wish you a fantastic rest of the week. Make sure you uh, write up to us, leave that honest written review as well as rating. And most importantly, take today's conversation and put it into practice. I'll be here waiting for you on the very next conversation. So until then, go I make it a great day. And thank you very much. Trust that you enjoyed today's conversation. And once again, today's conversation was sponsored by First Generation Capital Partners. If you're an accredited investor and want to find out more about how we're helping accredited investors to gain their personal freedom even faster, go to firstgencp.com forward slash going long.